coffee. That's how you get the day started every day. Hello everyone, my name is Gabby Manassa, Regina class of 2014, and I'm super excited to be virtually speaking with all of you about a day in the STEM life. Um, you know, just a little bit of background about myself. After I graduated from Regina, I went to the great Michigan State University where I graduated in 2018 with a major in finance and then a minor in entrepreneurship and innovation. So after I graduated the last two and a half years, I've been out in Chicago where I um, am working now for JP Morgan Chase Bank, as many of you are probably familiar with. And as of recently, I decided I guess I want to go back to school. And so I am in my first semester at Wayne State University doing my Master in Business Administration um, with a concentration in Finance. So a day in the STEM life. I just want to highlight that finance is a form of business. It's really centered around cash, the flow of cash, cash movement, investing. Um, and historically, this has really been a male-dominated industry. Even in my classes at Michigan State two and a half to three years ago, I was one of maybe five females in a class of 50. And so I think it's really important to highlight this as a field. Um, especially because finance is very equation heavy, a lot of problem solving, very mathematical. And so I, I think it can really fall under that mathematical vertical of what STEM stands for. So with everything being said, I'm just going to stop talking now. I'm going to show everyone what my typical day looks like, which it's all virtual right now because of the COVID-19 situation. It consists of work. Uh, collaborating with my coworkers, but then also switching gears and studying, getting homework done throughout the day for my classes. So please enjoy. I am now currently working on some online homework. Here's a little preview of what some of the questions are. This is a corporate finance class, so again, a lot of calculations. So as I'm working through this homework, here is my scratch paper of all the math that is going on. So now I'm working on a deposit value calculator. Uh, it's based in Excel, but really what this does is it prices out how much that we can make at the bank if a company decides that they want to drop a certain amount of money and leave it with us. Thanks for spending the day with me. Please don't hesitate to get my contact information and reach out if you have any questions.